So one of my favorite polymer pistols in my inventory right now is the CZ. And I have two of them in my inventory. They're both awesome in my opinion. And CZ is one of those brands that I think uh, they're under-realized in a sense. Uh, they got a lot of expensive stuff, but they do have good stuff that's reasonably priced, just like the Glocks and the Smith & Wessons out there. And these are two examples. Uh, Glock and Smith & Wesson seem to have the lion's share from what I can see, and especially with law enforcement contracts. And that's no real surprise because they're both really good guns. But CZs, uh, for the most part, I think they have really, really solid, capable firearm setups. And I think they surpass Glock and Smith & Wesson in a lot of different ways. So uh, these two right here are, uh, I have the P10, which is my favorite striker fired that I have in my inventory right now. I, I have a lot of other ones, and uh, I, I kind of go back and forth as far as which one I prefer to shoot, but it seems like the P10 seems to come back out on top every time. And the P10 is just amazing to shoot. If you haven't shot one, this is the P10F. They also have the P10Cs. I haven't really messed too much with the P10Cs. This is the full size. I like full size handguns for the most part, uh, with a few exceptions like this one right here. But, uh, you know, the full-size P10F is just an awesome shooter. It's extremely flat shooting. It has a much better trigger than the Glock, in my opinion. Uh, everything on it is just really well made. The machine work, all that good stuff. It does have good aftermarket support, so if you want to throw bells and whistles on it. Uh, and, for the most part, you're either going to see it for the same price as a Glock or even a little bit cheaper than a Glock. So, I'm one of those people that might say, hey, if you want to get something a little bit different than just a standard Glock, or even just like a standard M&P 9 from Smith & Wesson, I'd say get one of these. Uh, the P07 right here, this is more of a compact size. Uh, I could, I'm looking for a good uh, CZ P09 because I want the full-size hammer fired, uh, just to kind of go along with the P10 here. But the P07 is an awesome, it's more of a uh, compact frame, kind of like the Glock 19 is. But for a hammer-fired polymer gun, I really, really enjoy it. The double action isn't the best double action out there. I think SIGS is a little bit better, but the single action is really good. Uh, it's basically the kind of updated, modernized, if you will, approach to the CZ75 design. So I really, really enjoy it. Uh, the biggest thing about these that I really like is not only the fact that they're really reliable and they have good ergonomics in, in my hands, is the detail of the gun. And just as an example, what I'll show here. So here's the P10F, okay? So I didn't really do much to this gun. I just put a little towel and grip on it, threw a light on it so far, and then uh, Strike Industries uh, magazine base plate. But as far as the slide, I haven't updated it at all. But the contours are really good. The slide serration is very well done. And just to show in contrast, this is a Glock 17 that I have, Gen 4. Very good. I really, really dig the Glock 17. It's a very well-made gun. But when I compare the two of them, even when you look at the lettering, you look at how the slide serrations are done, just the cuts on the slides, uh, the frame, just a little bit of differences there. It seems like the P10 is more finished, if you will. A little bit more polished to it. That's why I like it. Uh, nothing against the Glocks. I really, really enjoy Glocks. Uh, I love Glocks as well. They're awesome, awesome guns. But out of the two, if you're going to say, okay, uh, you're trying to sell either the P10F to somebody or a Glock 17, and you're taking everything into account, which one are you going to pick? I'm probably going to pick the P10 versus the Glock 17. So anyway, just quick video. I really, really enjoy CZs. I know that not every single one of the CZ models out there are great. Uh, that's with any handgun. There are some that I might not be uh, into, but their basic models, the P10, the P09, P07, uh, the old CZ75s that they got out, uh, the P01, all those good models out there, they work really, really well. Um, I think maybe if they changed their marketing or something and really did a marketing push, maybe they could get a little bit more of the chunk of the pie when it comes to like the law enforcement market or, or something like that. Um, that's just my opinion because they certainly do well. Um, shooting a gun like a CZ P10, it's almost like cheating, honestly. If you haven't shot one, shoot a CZ P10F, a full size. 
and you'll be amazed at how flat and how nice the trigger is straight from the factory. You're going to be like, holy crap, this is way better than a Glock uh, the first time you, you squeeze the trigger. So in any case, enough yammering out of me. Put your thoughts in below. This is just kind of an opinion piece. I really like CZ. These are kind of my favorite guns. I know CZ has a reputation for kind of being a yuppie gun or whatnot or a hippie, hipster type gun. I get it, but I mean, they're really well made. They're really good handguns. So with that said, stay safe out there and look forward to reading the comments.